Hi Vogue, my name is Kyla Jo and today I will be showing you my no makeup makeup look. Let's get right into it. What's up y'all? Okay, so what we're doing right now, y'all, we're about to get into this makeup, no makeup look right now. We in Miami, so you know that type of weather is going to be a little hot, okay? So these are the times where I will wear no makeup look, but it's makeup, you know? So what we want to do is we want to clip these bad boys, these little hairs, to the back. To the back. <laughs> We're going to start with some moisturizer first. So I like to go in with my Ultra Repair. Look, look at that. That's how you know your girl been using it so much. For my dry skin, for anybody that has dry skin, like when I tell you, this is the bomb bomb.com so if you got dry skin ladies like i mean desert type of skin use this because this will do the job a little goes a long way so i'm just using a little bit well i'm not using a little bit but <laughs> but now i'm gonna get into the eyebrows darling i like to go to with the eyebrows first and then work our way up okay so that's what we're gonna do. What I like to use is the the she the she glam eyebrow, and I just use this. I just use the spoolie, and I just brush my eyebrows up. That's all I'm doing right now. Just using the she glam spoolie brush. They have a obviously this is a brow pencil. I use it every now and then, but this is not my brow pencil that I use. I just use the spoolie, and that's it. Now we're gonna get right into the brow pencils that I use. So the brow pencils that I use is the Benefit Precise My Brow Pencil. And I tell you, it is precise, darling, precise. She is precise. <laughs> so I don't know why, but I just like brushing my eyebrows up even though I, have, I already did it. I think it's because of the fact that my, well, my hair, all around my hair is curly so sometimes my hair cannot stay in place so i just kind of like train them like hey we pushing you up baby we pushing you up <laughs> so get a lie and then i also have to remind myself that my eyebrows are not twins they are literally cousins i'm gonna line these babies up we're gonna line my eyebrows up so let's get ready to do it so i like to start with a natural brow I used to go crazy back in high school when I was like around 16 or 17 and I used to just go like mad crazy and like really like going on my eyebrows like that was just ooh. then I'm gonna go with another brow pencil that I like to use is my favorite ColourPop Precision brow pencil in the color Banya Brunette the number is four, I use four. So it looks like it's very crayon based. So you're just gonna have to lightly, you know. I use this for the front as well, but I sometimes like to shape my eyebrow. So I like to start it with this to shape my eyebrow. It's actually hard doing brows on, like using my, you know, using this phone as a mirror. It is tricky. Then sometimes I like to put a line right here a little bit. Sometimes it just depends on how my eyebrows are looking like right now they're kind of entrained yeah this is yeah it's not too bad i just need to yeah it's not too bad and for my girls out there who try to like learn how to do eyebrows let me take your time if there is no rush i did not learn how to do eyebrows overnight and you're not gonna learn how to do eyebrows overnight it takes time and patience. You have to get to know your eyebrows just like how just like how anybody else would get to know their eyebrows. You have to learn how your hair is, which way your hair is grow. Like, you know, where do they lean at? Like, where do they fall at? Where do they naturally fall at? So, you just have to kind of get to know your eyebrows. Be like, okay, you shape this way. Oh, you go that way. Oh, you go this way. So, I just, over time, you know, the arrows of my eyebrows, like I used to kind of, one time a, a guy made fun of me back in high school, my eyebrows were so dark. Cause I used to go really ham. I used to go ham in with my eyebrows, baby. Now, I like to lightly go in with the concealer to shape my eyebrows just a little bit. I either use 
I use these bad boys. These are the best concealers. If you're not on a budget, this is the best concealers for you, darling. This is just the best, overall the best concealers. Everybody in my mother has LA Pro Girl Concealer and they are literally like $3. So get you some LA Pro Girl Concealer. Well, the shade that I either use, depending on how I'm feeling, technically this is my shade, the Tofi. I can honestly use this as a foundation, but I just don't. But I sometimes go in with the fawn, so it just depends on how I'm feeling. So I'm probably gonna go with the Tofi today. I also have a makeup, what would you call it? But I use this to put foundation, eyebrow stuff on here, concealer. I mostly put it on concealer and foundation on here because sometimes when you're traveling, stuff like that, sometimes you're not gonna have a table or or I used to use paper. I know I don't know if people know that, but you can also use paper too. I used to really use paper heavily back in high school days when I didn't have this. So I just use, I just grab a sheet of paper and I basically cut it, like you know, rip it in half, and then you know, then I have me a little, you know, canvas. You know, I let it sit for a little bit. So right now, I like to go in with my lip ejection, Too Faced lip ejection. This gives you a little more plump on your lips. Like right now, my lips are, you know, I have the most volume under my bottom lip more than so the top lip. But I like to just go over it just a little bit to give it a little bit of a plump. But I really go in on my top lip because my top lip don't really have that much love. I let it sit in, and when I tell you guys, it has a sizzling feeling, so I just wanna, I just wanna warn you that you're gonna feel a little tinglish to the point that you might may feel like, oh, I should take this off. We're gonna go with this, we're gonna lightly use it. We're just gonna lightly underline the eyebrows. We ain't gonna go in on it. Lightly use it, see? You see how lightly I did that? Ooh, see, now it's tingling now, y'all. It's kicking in. <laughs> it's kicking in. It is kicking in. Whew. It's kicking in. Going over with the concealer just a little bit. Okay, that was kind of too much, but that's okay. We can make it up with the, um, there you go. See, that was too much, but that's okay. That's okay, because that's why we got foundation and all that. We, we can make it up with it, okay? Now we're gonna blend in the concealer. Now, sometimes I like to blend in the top right here, because this obviously needs to be blended. So I kind of like to use either both of these, it just depends on how I'm feeling or whatever I see in my makeup bag. Use this, and I'm just gonna have blended, blended in. Oh yeah, you guys don't know, but one time I was actually featured on Vogue um, website. That was really, I was not expecting that. Honestly, my friend at the time, Alicia, she took a picture of me coming out of the um, bus and she was like, let me take a picture of you in your outfit. And you guys can check it out for yourself too. If you want, I'll put the link down in the description box down below. Long story short, I don't really remember to be exact because it's been so long ago. They emailed my mother it was saying like, hey, we would love to feature you in the um, back to school outfits, ideas, something like that. And at the time, I did not really know what Vogue was, but one mom was screaming. She came in and she was like, I'm like, huh? Still don't really understand. But now, <laughs> but now, I'm like, oh, she gotta really pack yourself on the back sometimes. Cause you know, sometimes we're so eager to be like, oh, I don't, you know, I don't think I'm doing this right. I don't think, you know, I don't have it all together. You know, da 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 da. But really, babe, you done came a long ways. You done did this, you done did that, you know? So try to be, give yourself a little bit of grace. Give yourself, put some respect on your name, okay? You want these other people to respect your name. Respect your own name too. Put some respect on your name. I'm using that e.l.f. Clear Brow and Lash and Mascara. Sometimes this helps me a lot to let my eyebrows stay in place. Even though you got them lined up, you still gotta train them to be like, okay, we stay right here and that is it. <laughs> And then, you know, sometimes I like to give it that like bush effect, like that like bushy effect. Now we're gonna get into the makeup. First, I like to, now that I have acne, 
I would like to start off with an orange corrector. So the orange corrector that I'm going to use, I'm going to use is the LA Pro Girl Concealer. I told you I use every LA Pro Girl Concealer. I'm going to use this a little bit. A little bit goes a long ways. Like any acne that I have. I'll go in with my Real Technique brush with the medium shadow brush. This you supposed to actually use this for your eyeshadow, but I use this for my concealer. I act like that this is my whole new skin. Like I make a whole new skin if that makes sense. You'll see you guys, I don't know how to explain it, but I just make this as a whole new skin because you know I have, you know, acne and all that. So I kind of trying to treat this as like, okay, I'm building my new skin with the concealers and all that. And then I go in with my foundation. Now we can go in with my concealer. I like to use the Makeup Forever. This is perfect for someone who has really, like, not really bad acne, but if you want that, kind of like that full coverage, but if you want a light coverage, I suggest that you should use NARS concealer. I use both of these every now and then, whenever, I, you know, depending on the mood, but I have to get a, a darker shade because now that it's the summertime and this shade i'm not really the shade lightly go over like like this like i just go over like because it's definitely full coverage so i just try to go in like this is my shade yeah this is definitely my shade so I just go in then we're gonna damp our beauty blender okay we use hot water. Damp, always damp your beauty blenders with hot water. It's gonna get the job done. If I were you, I would get the beauty blenders, the original beauty blender, cause this really works. But if you want like a light dab, this is for you. But if you want like a type of dab that you wanna get into it, make sure it's in there, get you a small beauty blender. It's gonna change your life. I'm gonna have to get a new one because I've been using that for almost two years now and it's time for a new one so i'm about to dab this concealer in look at that y'all look at that dab it in you guys please put makeup foundation on your neck you don't want to be looking crazy out here ladies please make sure you put that on your neck because i've seen too many women that i have seen who don't put foundation on their neck i'm gonna go in with this and we're gonna like lightly blend into our skin so that they don't see the dark spots see do you see them anymore no exactly exactly okay look at it you know you can't really tell and this is my new skin this is like like actually like my skin you know this is really good i'm telling y'all this is really it's good all right so now we're gonna get into the foundation sometimes if I'm in that type of mood, I want to go, you know, I'm going out and hang out with my friends. If I want that nice, medium to full coverage type of look, you know what I'm saying? I'm going to go in with my NARS concealer. But if I want something that's very light, that's like no makeup makeup look, I'm going to go with my Fenty Beauty Pro Filter Hydration Foundation. So, anybody that has dry skin, now you know to get you a Fenty Beauty Hydration um, Hydration Pro Filter foundation i think honestly nars is really dedicated to people who have dry skin in my opinion but you can obviously use it regardless of your type of skin or whatever but it's a lightly use we're not going to use too much we in miami you know we need anyway so we're going to take this right here not put too much because look that's already holding up so we want to tap okay we're gonna boom 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 not that much. You do not. I can use a whole lot. Blend this bad boy in. I'm just going light, so this is what my makeup will actually look like. So this is my no makeup makeup look. We're done. We're almost done. We're almost done. Not just yet. Now I like to give myself a little bit of a bronze type of look situation. So I'm gonna go in with the makeup by Mario bronzer. His bronzer is literally amazing. You don't even need a whole lot right here. It's in shade deep. So we're just gonna lightly use it. I'm gonna lightly. When I tell you, it's like, woo. Okay, I'm about to use too much. Let me just tap like that, and then we're gonna lightly, like lightly go around my forehead. Like it's 
it's really like because you can kind of tell right here you can kind of see it right there the contour sometimes i use it as a contour next we're gonna go in with our blush and then that is it i'm gonna use the she glam beauty plush palette in the shade brick red 04 and this right here you gotta you know you gotta be into it a little bit so i just like to if you want that you know pigmentation you know and it kind of gives you that little highlight with it you can that you know little cute little oh with our morphe setting spray this is really good setting spray if you want your makeup to stay a little bit longer it gives you that little mist Right on. Last but not least, I use lip gloss. And the lip gloss that I've been currently been using, shout out to B. Simone for giving me her whole lip collection. And actually, the lip gloss is really good. I'm like, I'm not, <laughs> I'm not, you know, this, I use what I like. That's one thing about me, y'all. If I'm ever promoting something to you, or if I'm ever, you know, sharing something, I actually like it. So I'm using the B. Simone shade in diamond i used to want to use this in diamond when i tell you baby Ooh. <laughs> all right Alrighty, guys i hope you guys enjoyed my no makeup makeup look it looks really good love it now i'm gonna get dressed get ready to go out and see what my is all about Bye, bugs. Bye, cattles. Bye, bye, jettles. I love you guys so much. Mm -hmm.